Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to find all complex numbers of a polynomial function. Now, when it comes to finding all complex numbers, one of the things that people f tend to forget is that real numbers, all real numbers are actually complex numbers. So we're going to talk about a general strategy on how to find all the complex numbers uh, going forward. Now, the one thing to remember is you are applying the fundamental theorem of algebra. What that pretty much tells you here is that a polynomial of degree n has n zeros. In other words, we'll have the number of solutions will match the overall degree. Now, one thing that you want to use in terms of a tool is the rational zero test. And this is a very popular test used in pre-calculus. And it's basically p over q. Now, p are all the factors of the constant term, and q is all the factors of the leading coefficient. Now, from here, you want to take into account also the linear factorization theorem. In other words, being able to write the polynomial in terms of all the zeros, but in terms of the x powers, all the x powers will be of degree 1. So it's going to be x plus something, x minus something. And the other thing to consider is when it comes to trying all, finding all complex numbers, irreducibility. Now, ir ir irreducibility refers to when, can so when is something not reducible. Now, since you're talking about finding all complex numbers, this will not, not necessarily be an issue. But if your objective is to find all rational numbers, all real numbers, then irreducibility is something to consider. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's a general strategy on how to find all the complex numbers in a polynomial equation.